Catalytic converter thefts have been on the rise with thieves targeting cars across the metro. But over the holiday weekend, the school bus company First Student was hit. Sharon Yu shares the latest from Brooklyn Park Police. Brooklyn Park Police are investigating what they're calling a crime of opportunity. They say over the long Thanksgiving weekend, somebody broke into this bus lot and stole 10 catalytic converters. It's a frustration. Brooklyn Park Police Inspector Elliot Faust says his department didn't hear about this until everyone was back in office. Monday morning they came back and found that somebody had cut into their security gate and then stolen 10 catalytic converters off of um, their buses. Faust says not only did the thieves have the luxury of time, but also the ease of access. Buses being higher up off the ground, you can slide right underneath there very easily, cut the catalytic converters off and be gone without having to jack the car up. First student, the company that owns the buses, said in a statement that only a few routes were delayed by 10 to 15 minutes as a result. But Faust says the issue of catalytic converter thefts has been chronic and consistent, with 350 catalytic converters stolen this year alone. It's a big impact, and, and if you look at our map, our crime map, um, and look at where all these are all happening at, it's um, it's throughout the entire city. Faust says holding thieves accountable in these cases is difficult. There's a lot of times when they're stolen, there's no surveillance footage or when there is, you know, maybe the person's wearing a mask and you can't identify them. We just haven't had a lot of luck with it. And so I guess the approach that we've taken is really an educational approach. Like we want to get the message out to the public, like be aware of this big problem that's going on. Police are continuing their investigation and in the meantime, they say they are relying on the public for any information. In Brooklyn Park, Sharon Yu, CARE 11 News.